Hey there, Curselings, Curselord Nick here, and jumping back into the quarry, and I believe we're going to be uh, starting the chapter 2, and it's going to be Nick and Abby, so let's get ahead and jump on in and start that. I tried to exit out of it uh, last episode before it started, so we could start this one fresh. So here we go. It'd be a lot easier with Mr. H's chainsaw. It's really very pretty out here when there's no kids around. Yeah, they can get kind of obnoxious, huh? <laughs> yeah. They always seem to listen to you during painting class. You've seen my class? Just walking by. <laughs> the art cabin's all the way out of the way. Yeah, well, there's this shortcut that I take that goes by. Which way should we go? Why don't you choose? <laughs> let's see Shady Glade or Rocky Road. Uh, let's go to Shady Glade because uh, just thinking about that little uh, image we saw with the falling rocks. <laughs> oh. oh my god, are you okay? I'll be okay. <laughs> Come on, I'll spot you. Oh, this is a big area. Try to see if I find anything that looks interesting. I see something shiny over here, so I'm gonna go over here. See, there's a the box. What's this? The ranger I... box. Try to do it before they start talking, because it gives you a, like a split second. A box in the woods unlocked. Inside is a change of clothes, bottled water, and supplies. Provisions for a ranger, perhaps? Do these woods even? Have a ranger. It's a ranger box. Oh. Like a supply cache for rangers or whatever if they're out in the woods. Naked rangers? <laughs> so it would seem. <laughs> Alright, here's a crazy theory. But what if Hackett was the creature? And that's why he was so freaked out. He was trying to get them to leave, and that's why he left. Ooh, that'd be an interesting twist, right? That's just a total guess. <laughs> like, I don't even know if any of that's uh, true or not, but... Uh, let's see. Is there anything over here? So where does this dream actually go? The lake. Oh, yeah. Duh. <laughs> Okay. We learned some information we already knew. <laughs> oh, I thought he was going to do something for a minute there, but he just kind of like walked into the tree. <laughs> oh, I thought I saw something. I swear I just like heard something click. That's where we came down, right? Okay, there's like a trail right here. I'm just gonna follow the trail. I'm not 100% sure what's happening, but I would imagine we're looking for, you know, sticks. <laughs> it's like maybe I gotta look up a little bit more. 
Oh, here we go. I think we're back near the path again. I know where we are. Yeah? Up here. Here, hold these. Sure. This view is just... Let's go with Sincere. <laughs> Damn, Abby, you're really good. No, no, this is nothing. <laughs> no, really, I'm not just saying that. This is rough, but if I can get a little bit of it down, then I'll remember it better later. It's really cool you know that about yourself. Um, yeah, I guess so. I mean, not everyone knows what they're capable of, you know? I'm sure you're capable of a lot, Nick. I mean, of course, I just... Don't know what. You'll figure it out. Did you hit up? Hmm? Probably nothing. No, listen, there's something there. <laughs> Look! It's so tiny. <laughs> My God, he's so cute. <laughs> Stop breathing, tricking the beast into taking you for nothing but a corpse. And where's the fun in hunting then which is already dead? Watch the visuals alter or listen to the sound change as the threat approaches. When the danger has passed, run. Pick the right moment and run for your life. Be warned. Exhaling or running at the wrong time may just mark you as the creature's quarry, causing serious consequences. Oh no. cheerful I'll be like just imagine at least we gave her a good story to tell her pig husband how do you know it was the mommy pig mm, I got a pretty good look Ew. I think she was coming on to me oh got yourself a little girlfriend she wasn't that little <laughs> there's no 
Guess we should head back. All right, we survived the boar. Okay, Caitlin, is she on her own? get my phone back and it's just a big dumb brick alright let's see ok it doesn't look like we can go too far this way I have a feeling we gotta look at the house and then Alright, uh, let's see. Hey, Caitlin. Guess what? Mr. H is a voyeuristic creep. He has hidden cameras everywhere and a secret room. No, that's not... Uh, whoa, no. Back up. What? His eyes are everywhere. He's always watching us. Look it off, man. He, he just got... Trail cameras set up, you know, forest surveillance, that kind of thing. Oh, you don't think that's weird? Well, he's got a perimeter to check, kids to protect. You know, probably just to keep track of wildlife. You guys have no imagination. So, uh, what's going on here? Everything ready? Mm, let's go, yeah, let's go with a uh, weird light. I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. Yeah, that was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Brian. The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I told you never to say Hag of Hackett's Quarry again. What's wrong with saying Hag of Hackett's Quarry? Are you done? You know, I just realized we may never see each other again after tonight. You can't have just realized that. Just trying to set the mood. What mood? The mood, the vibe, you know. Speaking of setting the mood, I have work to do. Okay, because playlists don't make themselves. I mean, I guess they do, but... All right, right guy. Time to get wood. Yikes. Wording. Oh, I know what I said. Abby, Nick, just in time. We got wood. <laughs> We've already done that joke. It's mostly just kindling. Oh, that's all we need. There's already a big pile of logs here. We could have gotten more, but there was a hog or a boar. But Nick was very, very brave and took one for the team. <laughs> Look at the hog of Hackett's quarry. Oh my gosh, it can't be. The hog of Hackett's quarry? What? I thought you hated that phrase. Big jokes take big sacrifices. You're so brave. Oh, I just want to shrink you down to little pocket people and put you in my pocket and peep at you when I need a little pick-me-up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Special delivery! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Where the hell did that gun come uh, from? Dude, relax, okay? It's not even real. Uh... Well, I mean, it's a real gun, but it's just for shooting bears. We found it in the storage room. Okay, fine. Fine, we'll put it down. Thank you. Guns are no joke, dipshit. And, and... We bring you a hand-picked selection of only the finest that Hackett's Quarry has to offer. No freaking way. Yes, freaking way. Pop, pop, peanut butter, butter pops. Pop, pop, pop them in your mouth. Pop! I didn't even know you could still find these anywhere. Hey, hey, hey. Cool your jets there, cowboy. All right, these are spoken for. Dude, you can't just shove those in my face and not expect me to want to pop, pop, pop them in my mouth. Come on. Emma, please hand me the shotgun. What, you're gonna shoot me over them? No, dumbass. Okay, we are going to shoot for them. 
Nah, dude. Absolutely not. No. Yeah, I'm gonna be like, I'm not leaving you with a gun. There is no way I'm leaving you dillweeds alone with a gun. Come on, look, the shooting range is like right over there, okay? It'll be fun. Okay, look, you and me, old fashioned shootout. First prize, peanut butter butter pops, all to yourself. Dude, I guess you don't really want them then, huh? Fine, you're on. Yeah, boy! Jacob, hand me that gun now. I mean, nobody's handling any firearms if you're gonna act like a dick about okay, it. Okay, then you can be the ref. We need an objective third party. Okay, we're trying to get a party started here, Jacob. Okay, well, the main party's not gonna die just because you're off on a little side quest. Come on. Please. All right. Yeah. Guess we're gonna have ourselves an old-fashioned shootout. Yeah. Look, there's a clearing we can use as a shooting range back there, but if I see either of you dicking around, I am turning this car around. Oh, uh. we'll be good. All right. Okay, so just so you know, I was an expert marksman, <clears throat> third class, three years in a row, ranked highest in camp each year. I'm just letting you know that your goose is cooked, Nick, but if you back down now, I might let you just have one little peanut butter butter pop if you're lucky. No way. You've never even seen me shoot. Yeah, that's because you've never shot before. Yeah, not that you know of. <laughs> okay, I think I would know if okay, you're actually... Okay, boys, I'm gonna have to stop you right there. As much as I'm enjoying your charming machismo, the moment we step foot on the shooting range, we're playing by my rules, okay? And what I say goes. Got it? Okay, good. Now I'm gonna go set up some targets and get more shells. Do not move a muscle or touch his gun until I'm back. All right, so is it just me? Is it kind of hot when she gets all bossy like that? I'm always hot, pencil Yeah, deck. okay, thank you. Bye, bye. So, um, how's your little one-on-one -on -one with Abby in the woods? That's a hopeful. It was... It was okay. Hey! a boy! So, I mean, what happened? Well, we flirted a little. She's... really smart. Yeah? Mmm, yeah. I mean, you see the deal? Don't be gross. No, 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 hey, look, no sweat, okay? We all get performance anxiety sometimes. You just better make your move before a real man swoops in. Speaking of, let me show you how a real man shoots his gun. Are you guys seriously still thumping your chest at each other? No, I think he's got brain damage. <sighs> okay, please, just give me the gun. Uh-uh. You'll have it when I say you'll have it. All right, huddle up, boys. This is how we're going to do this. You're shooting the one on the left. Nick first, then Jacob's turn. Keep your fingers off the trigger till you're ready to shoot. You got it? Aye, aye. All right. Two things. Remember the spread. Remember the recoil. This is a shotgun. We're not sharpshooting here. The flashlight shows you where you're aiming. Obs. All right. <laughs> Let's check this out real quick. I'm sorry to have to say there may well be times during your stay at Hackett's Quarry where you'll have to defend yourself <laughs> using potentially deadly force. When engaging in combat, simply aim your weapon and shoot where the flashlight is pointed. Take note, if you're up close and personal with your target, you'll do more damage. The farther away, the larger the spread, and injuries may not be fatal. There's a time and place for the use of weapons, and you may want to consider all your options. Remember, it's not always wise to pull the trigger. That's how people get hurt. <laughs> Did we see the evidence one? Everyone likes a scavenger hunt. And at Hackett's Quarry, that's no different. There are secrets in these woods. Fun secrets that should you uncover them could help protect you from criminal prosecution. After all, the stories you'll take with you are only stories without the proof to back them up. So it's time to dive into the mystery, take pictures, or find pieces of evidence. 
and you may just prove your innocence. Or not. <laughs> okay. Saw that, saw that. Okay. Alright, so... Alright, Nick! One point! Oh, like okay, we're too far back to do any real damage. Let's scooch forward a little and uh, fuck these guys up. Okay, you're good. All right, Nick. This time for real. All right, let's see. Nice shot. I'm lucky. <laughs> Point to you, Nick. Good job, Nick. All right. Let's see what you got. All right. You might want to uh, avert your eyes, Nick. I don't want to give you any more performance anxiety. Uh, all right, all right. Just shut up and shoot, Jacob. Huh. I thought you were an ultra elite pro marksman. Yeah, with like a rifle. Whoa, okay, dude, not with this freaking cannon dude, blaster. That is how you get someone shot. God. Nah, it's okay. You probably would have missed me anyway. Hey. Okay, disqualified for being a dumbass. What? No. <laughs> Let's just go. Good game. Sorry, Jacob. Better luck next time. <laughs> Butter luck next time? Hey, I didn't want to <laughs> say it, but you're both very mean. Blam, we thought this was over. What the what? Pop pop, peanut butter butter pops. <laughs> she just scooped in and stole it from she had just offered to split it. Okay. New idea. Party game. Mm. Uh, Come on, people. We might never see each other after tonight. Let's make some memories. Well, what do you have in mind? How about the ultimate game of secrets and lies, truth or dare, but Dylan style. Mm. Okay. House rules are: someone asks you truth or dare, then you choose, and then you do. And there's no ifs, ands, or buts. So, like, normal truth or dare? Yes. So we can, like, make people kiss? If they choose dare, yeah. As long as everyone consents, of course. Cool beans. I mean, keep it in your pants until it's your turn, but... Well, who does get to go first? Well, it's house deals, so... Abigail. Truth or dare? Really dodged a bullet, huh? All right, here goes. Have you ever slept with anyone? Oh, uh, I. <laughs> hey, take it easy, man. That's too far. Come on, I, I'm not finished. Um, Have you ever slept with anyone at this camp? <laughs> no. Nope. Sorry. All right, Abby, it's your turn. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, 
Uh, Abby, oh my God, just pick someone. Okay, okay. Um, I don't know. Ugh, ding, ding, ding. Too late. My turn. Ryan, truth or dare? Ooh, let's see. Uh, let's go dare. Dare. Give me what you got. Okay, Ryan. Your dare comes with a choice. Can't you do that? I can do whatever I want. <laughs> and I dare you to kiss either Caitlin or Dylan. Wow. I mean, I guess both is off the table. Sorry. I don't make the rules. And you literally <laughs> just did, but okay. Let's do this. <laughs> I have no idea. Let's just, I'm gonna go with Caitlyn though. Let's see. Caitlyn, shall we? Always happy to please. <laughs> Super awkward. <laughs> Alrighty, who shall I pick? Well, uh, me and Jacob haven't gotten a turn yet. Good point. Mm, let's go, Caitlin. Caitlin, what do you say? Truth or dare? Truth. Yeah, truth. Let's see. <laughs> oh, that could be interesting. I'm going to go with interested. When you were a kid, what did you want to be when you grew up? Uh, that's kind of a boring question. Got an answer. Well, the answer is, I don't know. That's the truth. Sorry. So, guess it's my turn. Nope. What? I smell bullshit. Okay, fine. You got me. I wanted to be a street performer. <laughs> no way. Well, um, <laughs> a street performer? You mean like, um, <laughs> like... No asshole, like a mime or you know one of those statue guys that move when you give them a dollar. Caitlin is a mime. Yeah, no, I just can't imagine that. Thanks, Ryan. Well played. Now it's my turn. Emma, there. Emma, so you have to kiss. Jacob or oh. Nick. Uh. <laughs> well then. Um uh sorry, Nick. This is not uh, even there, obviously. I don't know if that's a good this. idea. I choose Nick. Uh oh. Abby's gonna be upset. M seriously? Guys. Guys! Thank you, Nick. He's good. You're like kissing my girlfriend, asshole. It was just a game. Hey, I am nobody's <laughs> girlfriend. The fuck it was. It was just a game. Yeah, the fuck it was, man. Jacob, grow up. Mm. Well, I guess I should probably go after him. You should probably go find Abby. So, anybody want to play part cheesy? What?
Welcome back. I am, as always, delighted that you're here. So, then, what more has been found? You return without any more of my cards. Yet you return nonetheless. Why is that, do you think? I can't help you without the cards. I want them found. I want them returned to me. Please, my friend. That's all I have to say for now. Secrets remain buried and the night grows darker. I'll see you again. You can count on that. Be careful. Where the wolves go, the ravens follow. Oh, I did not do good there. We're like not finding the cards. <laughs> okay. Let's see what happens here. Chapter 2. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and quit to menu here. And we'll end the episode at this spot. And then, so as always, thank you so much for watching. You guys know what to do. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.